welcome back if you watched my last video you'll see that in this video i said i was going to do something to the rear end of the car we are going to be doing a rear modification however we need to finish off the front end first so if you watched the last video you would have noticed that i put the grill on but i had to take the audi badge holder off the reason for that was because my badge that come with the car was too big I have ordered a smaller badge and I've tried to fit the smaller badge however I don't like the car uh, I don't like the badge holder that I've got the badge holder sticks out far too much from the car I think it looks stupid so instead what we're gonna do is use some adhesive to put the old Audi badge onto the grill and just stick the badge directly onto the grill however that badge is not just your standard Audi badge I have done something to change it if you saw the first video well not the first video if you saw the brake caliper video then I did say I'm gonna have a theme not a theme but an accent color to this car so if you watch that one you'll know what color this is if not you'll see it here She want me to lock it down, but I told her to pass the key You gotta slow it down, girl, you moving too fast for me Nobody did it like this, so they wonder, they asking me If I can slow it down, cause it's coming too fast for me Baby, don't try it, just stop it You should know that I got options I be fly like I live in the cockpit Mess around with the money, get drop kick. Only one in the city to pop quick Never cared about being your top ten Got a house in the hills, can you top this? I came from where them boys do you top this And get crazy around here in my section all of my ops get to step in. Know how long I had prayed for these blessings. Took my L's and turned them to left. So, I've made a whoopsie. I thought my car's MOT ran out next month. Turns out it ran out four days ago. So, we're currently on the way to the test center. Um, it should pass. There should be no reasons that it won't pass. I do need to put my number plate on though because currently uh, my number plate is sat somewhere in the back seat. Uh, I hope Oh, yeah There we go So, need to put Number plate on um, I need to No, that's it I just need to put number plate on We've recently changed The front brakes All four tyres Within the last Sort of five months um, Front two were done Last month We've done The drive shaft Driver side We've done All the suspension Obviously the coilover video Last video And So it should pass it, There should be no reason It shouldn't pass So Fingers crossed I mean Touched Wood Whatever Let's get to the test centre uh, I'm going to go to the gym but Luckily for me The test centre is right opposite the gym So I'll go to the gym While it's being tested And hopefully I'll get back to you guys With a smile on my face Saying it's passed With flying colours So Let's see so after that we uh, have been waiting quite a while it's now three o'clock i dropped the car off at 11 o'clock to be done at 11 o'clock but a uh, bit of a bit of a, a wait at the garage so it passed i do have a smile on my face uh we have two advisories which is brakes on the rear pads just need replacing soonish uh, and the front bushings on the lower control arm at the rear uh, both sides they're just starting to deteriorate a little bit but I mean we do have a few miles on this car I sat at about 140 um, so I'm happy with that good result and there's things I can change easily so I have plans on doing the brakes when the weather gets a bit nicer anyway moving on to the main modification for this video uh, we'll get to that now so we're at Bert's house, uh, we're going to take off the uh, stock exhaust pipes and tailpipes and put on the Miltec ones. Uh, I'll show you, show you what the stock ones look like. So, I mean, they don't fill up that, the hole at all. Well, over here, got this big old 
Miltec ones. So I'm going to jack the car up. We're going to cut off the stock ones. We've got some extra piping, extra clamps, and we're just going to clamp these on. It's not any performance enhancing. It's not any noise enhancing mods. This is solely for visual purposes. So I'm not going to film me jacking up the car. I'm going to jack up the car, uh, get it ready, and I will fast forward now onto cutting the stock tailpipes off uh, and getting these ones put on. <laughs> Yeah, I'm wedging it over at the minute though. Yeah, it's also hanging down a bit more because of the, um, hanging down a bit more. That one hangs down quite low anyway. So that one's hanging down just as low as that one is. Yeah, which is low. But it's, it's not lower than stock though. Do you know what I mean? That's the same, the exact same gap as that. It just looks low because it's a big, bigger exhaust. exhaust tip. Big thanks to Bert. Bert's just gone. He's got to go for dinner um, to his sisters. This is obviously his house. So again, thanks to Bert. The tailpipes are on. Tailpipe. I keep calling them tailpipes. They're just exhaust tips. So the exhaust tips are on. I personally think that they look so much better. If you like the content, then please smash the like button. Give us a subscribe. I am aiming to try and get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. That's my goal. Um, still fairly early on in the year, but that's what we're aiming for. So again, like, comment, let me know if you like them. Let me know what else you want to see and I'll catch you guys in the next video.